sometimes you do, you know, because that was like the golden era of hip hop. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It was like mm-hmm. when you know, it, like it, was, it, it was fun. You know what I'm saying? It, it was a it was a fun period. You know, in our careers, especially, you know, you know, times change and things, and people move on and things move on. So you know, mm-hmm. we just trying to maintain what we do now. Man, incredible! You know, Damn. we we were fans way before we even even knew Tupac or or you know uh, had any <clears throat> inter- interaction with him. You know, saying so by him being deaf or we being Rufus Records, but we was a fans way before that. You know, saying so again to actually become legends legendary with him at the same time is incredible. Yeah, like, Tupac was a beast. Yeah. You know, he he liked to, he liked to go in just like put a beat on. You know, what I'm saying just like. You know, it, 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 every beat he hear, he would get on. You know, it was, it was like, it, he just like a real like regular work dude. Like in every session, I was about her scene of me. Like you know, he, he just he just goes hard. And it's one of them dudes was a workhorse. Spent like hours and days, days and days in the funk, days in there in the lab like that. He's a real, real staunch workhorse type guy. You know. Raise the rights we ever received. Uh, God is one. You praise God and he's family first. I mean, you know, it's like, you know. Pretty much sums it up. Yeah. <laughs> Biggie was my dude. Biggie was real cool. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, just coming up, you know what I'm saying? Everybody from the same era, same, you know, time and, and, and not knowing who he's going to be at the same time doing tours and stuff like that. It was just, Biggie was a real cool dude, just like Pac, you know what I'm saying? Just love to get it in. My biggest accomplishment to myself is still being alive. You know, there's so many people in this industry that's here and gone, you know what I'm saying, made their impact and just gone. But that might be my biggest accomplishment, just being alive and still relevant to be able to do what we, you know, was blessed to do. I think I can second that. I definitely would like to second that because it's a, a great blessing, you know, being grateful to be here today and even having the opportunity to be here. You never know uh, what we're capable of, you know, window of opportunity is still open that's the situation and then uh you never know what phone thugs might pull off uh as we push forward into the future right now so you know it's to be seen you know it's like we got a great track record a great history but i think it's a lot still on the plate for bone thugs and harmony definitely